The House will be in order. The prayer will be offered today by our guest chaplain, Reverend John Sloop, First Presbyterian Church, Harrisonburg, Virginia. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we come in prayer knowing that you love us and are very much concerned about what goes on in this chamber today as these members seek to be good stewards of the trust placed in them by we, the people. We confess our human frailty and pray to be delivered from taking up today's agenda out of pure self-interest or peer pressure, but rather lead us, Lord, to do justice, to love mercy, and to walk humbly with our God. Father, grant each member wisdom in their thinking on the issues, courage in their convictions, and above all, grace in their attitudes toward one another. And when this day is done, may each one hear the Master say, Well done, good and faithful servant. Now, Father, with deep respect for the faith traditions of all members, I offer this prayer in the name of my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. The chair has examined examined uh, the Journal of the Last Day's Proceedings and announces to the House his approval thereof, and pursuant to Clause 1 of Rule 1, the journal stands approved. Uh, the Pledge of Allegiance today will be led by the gentleman from Texas, Mr. Poe. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. objection, uh, the gentleman from Virginia, Mr. Goodlatt, will be recognized for one minute. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, I'm pleased to introduce and welcome the Reverend Dr. John Sloop, Senior Pastor of First Presbyterian Church in Harrisonburg, Virginia, a church that has grown to over 1,100 members and over 500 attendees for Sunday services. Dr. Sloop has served the First Presbyterian Church and the Harrisonburg community since he received his calling in 1986. Dr. Sloop is passionate about seeing the Presbyterian Church renewed and growing again, and he has been actively involved in Presbyterian for Renewal, the Presbyterian Coalition, the Confessing Church Movement, and has served on the board of the Presbyterian Outreach Foundation. Dr. Sloop and his wife of 41 years, Gwen, are the proud parents of three children and two sons-in-law and have been blessed by five grandchildren. We welcome Dr. Sloop's family and other guests who join us today. And I'm honored to call Dr. Sloop a constituent and a friend, and I offer the thanks of this entire body today for his delivering the opening prayer.